Anyway, hi, good morning, happy Thursday. So I wanted to talk on here before I get to work. So I wanted to talk about scammers. There's so many scammers, especially since COVID, um, trying to use people's uh, um, information to better, to get something out of it. Uh, my lip is bleeding, I'm chapped. And um, especially, and everywhere you can think, like on TikTok, there's scammers, lots of scammers. Um, they'll come on there and if someone has a bad relationship, they'll say, oh, you're so beautiful, blah, 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 and they'll try to suck you in and all that stuff, which years ago I was like, oh, that's nice, right? Then I realized, no. Um, plus, I've changed myself that I don't care about that stuff. So, well, not don't care. Well, you know what I mean. I'm secure in myself, and I know I'm beautiful, and um, I'm with someone that loves me, and that's all that matters. But then you got scammers like tarot card scammers and people free reading. You go on here and you go free reading. Oh, they're so nice. They're offering you free reading, and then you go on there, and then they want money. And first of all, I'm not going to give you money because I don't even know you. Why would I give you personal information, right? You're offering me something for free. If it's going to be for free, let it be for free. Don't sit there and scam people, right? You just look like a scammer when you're doing that anyway. I understand you need to make money, but don't say something's for free when it's not because that's just not cool. And I don't believe in scamming and I would never scam anybody. Um, I am not on here asking for money. I'm not on here asking for things. If I was to offer something for free to somebody, I'm offering something for free. Anyway, um, yeah, it's just, there's just so much. It's just flooded with scammers. And I know they'll get what they get. Uh, this thing called karma and and stuff but you know there's so many people that get sucked into it and they give them all their information um like i don't even buy things on on the phone like i don't i don't order stuff my sister does all the time but not me i'm old school uh it's just it's just not right like i just it just fathoms my mind you know um and some of them will use them, um, oh, I'm a light worker, or oh, I'm this and that, and um, follow me, and you follow them because, oh, you're following a light worker, you're following someone like yourself, and then they try to scam you. And it doesn't make people like, uh, uh, so, like um, people that are clairvoyant, people that are psychic, people that like all with all these great spiritual gifts, that they are using, because everybody can use it. Uh, they use it in a wrong way, and they may not even care to use it. They just want to be there to scam. And it makes other people look look, look untrusting. Um, all I can say is go to someone you know if they're going to do a tarot card reading. If they ask for money, don't. If they're offering something for free, cool. Okay, right on. Uh, limit the amount of... Um, information you're giving them like extremely limited amount of information um but i usually like to if i'm going to do a tarot card reading i'm going to pay for it i'm going to do old school i'm going to actually look for someone in my city or in my town and actually go there and pay for it physically not that you can't get scammed but they're if you're paying by cash there's nothing much they can do anyway um and like the store I go to, I always go there and spend money and they have a good reputation. But not that I wouldn't take things for free if they're offered. Anybody would. Um, but just think before you do. Um, I'll be right back.